Dangerous moments unfold this morning at the Saudi Daisy Walmart. What started as a routine shoplifting call turned into an officer being hit by a car and an incredible chase. News Channel 9's John Mabel joins us now with the details. John. Well, Kim, many people saw this chase. It started at the Saudi Daisy Walmart, raced through a small portion of Saudi, into Red Bank, and through the heart of downtown Chattanooga. Now, two of the three suspects got away, but only for a little while. And the good news, the officer hit is doing fine. This amateur cell phone video shows paramedics loading up Officer Craig Winters. Police say Michael Rankin was behind the wheel of this car and used it to pin Winters against his patrol SUV. Doug Cherry saw Rankin speed away from the Walmart. He also noticed something else. I heard like two shots far out, you know, go off. And uh, of course I started flinching and uh, then I seen this car, I started looking and I seen this car going across here speeding and a Saudi cop right behind it. Shots were fired. You can see the back glass is shattered. Initially, Anthony Cuevas was driving. Now, police say he stopped and cooperated. But officers say Rankin slid from the passenger side behind the wheel, then pinned Officer Winters. Next, he led police through a small part of Saudi Daisy into Red Bank and the heart of downtown Chattanooga. East Ridge officers located the car and arrested Rankin near the tunnels. Now, officers are still looking for the woman who was in the back seat. Meanwhile, it's a morning Doug Cherry will never forget. He's definitely trying to get away. He, he didn't want to be here in this Walmart parking lot. Now, Officer Craig Winters has been treated and released from the hospital. Meanwhile, the man we showed you in the story, Michael Rankin, has a bond of $342,000. He faces shoplifting, evading arrest, aggravated assault, and attempted murder. Kim and Calvin, back to you. John, thank you very much.